Hey, what's poppin' guys? It's your girl Nia Imani and I am back with another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button right down below and hit that post notification bell so you know when your girl is uploading like, duh! Give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below. This is my first video of the new year. So happy new year to all of you guys. I hope that this new year brings you so, 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 so much blessings, so much joy, so much love, so much just greatness. So yes, as you guys can see from the title today, I am doing an unboxing, which is not really an unboxing, but I'm doing an unboxing of, well, I am talking about my new Bay's luggage. I am so excited for this, so enough of this chit chat, let's just jump right into it. So I've been um, eyeing bays for a long time now. Um, I really, sorry for the barking by the way, Fendi is just very upset. Um, but yes, I've been wanting to get quality luggage for a while now. Um, just because, you know, I've normally just gotten like luggage from... TJ Maxx, Marshalls, places like that. And I mean, yeah, at times they have good brands, but it's, you know, I'm just ready to evolve and like spend money on quality things. Um, so yes, it was between, I was looking like at a lot of different um, companies. So I was looking at Away, I was looking at Bays, and I was looking at Monos. Um, I heard a lot of mixed reviews about Away and so I kind of stopped looking at away. And then it was really between Monos and Bays. But Monos is like, one, very expensive. Two, their shipping, at least from their website, will take a while to get to me because that's a Canadian brand. Um, and yeah, I just, I was just like, okay, it's giving Bays for many, many reasons. So I have... The 29 inch um, suitcase in the color Atlas. I posted on my Instagram if I should get it in beige or this pink color Atlas. And everyone voted for Atlas, which I was glad because pink is my favorite color and I really wanted this. But I needed to see if I was being obnoxious by getting pink. But I'm glad the folks on Instagram told me I wasn't being obnoxious. So, um... Yes, I got the suitcase and then I also got the mini Weekender um, tote bag. I got this bag instead of like the full size one because one, the full size one is huge. I have two friends that have it and it's it's huge. And two, I just, I don't really like super huge bags, you know what I'm saying? So. I got the mini one and I'm going to break down both. So the reason why I went with Bays for, there's a lot of many, many reasons, but as you can see, my Weekender bag is hanging on to my suitcase. This was one of the main reasons why I chose Bays. When I travel for the NBA, I have to have multiple bags. I have to have my check-in suitcase. And I have to have a carry-on suitcase with my costumes. And then I have like a backpack, a personal bag, just a whole lot, a whole lot. Of. So I needed something that can be very, very convenient. And so with this, like, um, this little part right here, let me just place this down real quick. With this little, oops, with this little section right here, as you guys can see, it pulls out this is as far as it pulls out and you can as you saw wrap a bag onto it so in my head i was thinking when i do i eventually want to get the full set i want to get the medium size suitcase and the carry carry on size suitcase i can like hook that up to this bag and go about my business in the airport um that's if you know god willing we have more travel opportunities this season. 
Um, but if not, I will be using it to either carry my purse on here or um, just any bags that I have. Um, with this Weekender bag, it does have this pouch part that you can either um, keep it open to go onto your suitcase like this, like to, on the handle, or you can zip this and use it as a pocket. Um, I probably won't use it as a pocket just because I probably won't, but let's get into the details. Um, it did come with a little clear little, what is this for, um, tag. You can put like your little contact information here. It did come with this detailed card, just giving you the details of the suitcase. Um, another reason why, first of all, let's get into the detail of like this pinkish, rose goldish color. Like, like, oh, love, love this. And I love this because the suitcase has a cushion for the handle so like when you're dragging it through the through the airport or out of the airport you're not uncomfortable because i hate when you have to like hold this for a long time the handle for a long time and it just gets so uncomfortable so there's that we also my, my one of my other selling points for me was this handle right here it has a weight indicator and so how it works is it either turns red or green. I, I forget which color, but I, I want to say red because red always means bad. But if it turns red, once you pack everything into it, that means that it's over 50 pounds. So that was another selling point for me because I have a lot of travel this year. Um, I'm going on a huge cruise at the end of this year. Um, and I feel I tend to overpack, so it's good to have a look uh, indicator that like just shows me okay, you're below 50 or you're over 50. And it has a TSA approved um, lock. I don't know if I'll use it or not, just because I don't know. But because this color is so beautiful and so perfect, I do tend um, on getting the cover for this, the plastic cover that goes to the base bags. They just didn't have it in stock when I purchased these items, but I'm definitely, definitely getting that because I refuse to get this beautiful suitcase scratched up. So yeah, those are the details on the suitcase. I am going to open it up just in a minute, but let's get into the details of this bag, okay? The Weekender bag, like I said, for me, this is like the perfect size. It has this under part which I'm glad that this part is um, leather material just because I hate when your bags start getting dirty underneath and it has the little these little things so that like it's not just like placed on the floor it's like little props but yes it has this shoe compartment as you can see like right here you can put shoes here or maybe like a little makeup bag whatever you want to put here i am going to do a video i'm and it's going to be uploaded on wednesday of what i can fit in this bag um i i plan on using this bag for like okay my cruise um you always want to pack like some clothes like you know when you walk on to the cruise ship like a little bathing suit, all of that. I tend to pack that in here. So I wanna see like how many outfits and stuff I can fit in here. Um, but yes, it has these straps, as you can see. Um, and then when you open it up, they also have the crossbody strap as well. And it feels like it has a little cushion. Um, but yes. This bag is like super, super deep. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm gonna give like, a, in my next video, the video that's just focusing on this bag, I'm gonna give a better, you know, view of it. But I love that it has the pouch for your, um, your laptop. I love that it has, you know, this little chain to connect your keys because I hate traveling and like you throw your keys in the, in a bag because it's like I don't need my house keys. 
And then when it comes time at the end of the vacation to find it, it's like always an adventure to find it. It has like these little pockets. I love that the material on the inside is nylon. So like in case you put a water bottle or a soda bottle in here and it spills, it won't get like ruined. But yeah, it's it's a pretty deep bag. Um, it is, like I said, smaller than the regular size one, but I'm glad that it is. So, also, I'm like, you can't really see my face, but I'm like five, four-ish. And here is how the bag looks on me. So, you see? Bag looks fine on me. So, I, like I said, I'm prepared. I'm going to do a video on this bag separately to show you how much stuff i can fit in here and how heavy it gets so talking about heavy let's get into this bag we're gonna unzip the suitcase oh that was the expander to expand it uh, Also, people was talking about how this suitcase is pretty heavy. I'm holding it with one arm, and this is also my bad arm. Um, and it's not heavy for me. Um, and like I said, this is my bad arm. So if I can hold it with one arm, so can you. But it's also empty. So here it is. Okay, so I had to bring y'all down a level. So we can get into the details of this suitcase, okay? So, it is a double-sided suitcase. I feel like, I just feel like in this day and age, you need a double-sided suitcase. That one-sided stuff is so like 2005. So, it comes with these straps, which is good because this is like a compression part. So when you pack, you put you put the flap down and it like compresses all your stuff. So it flattens it out so you can fit more clothes. Um, I love how it comes with this little pocket. I normally sometimes like put like socks and stuff in these little pockets. But yes. Um, also, this is my first time like really like opening up this suitcase and like touching things. This is also um, a pocket so you can put stuff in this little compression part. Which I think, for the money, for how expensive this suitcase is, I feel like the fact that they included so many different, like, pockets is perfect. So, you can also take this part out as well if you wanted to. Um, and then on this side, it has another little mesh part that you can put stuff in as well. Normally, when things have, like, these... I like normally put like undergarments and stuff like that either in these little mesh pockets or in these pockets on this side. And then this is the suitcase part, okay? Where you put all of your clothes, duh. Um, it is pretty, it's pretty deep. This thing's about to fall. Um, it's pretty, it's definitely pretty deep. Um, let me do it like this. Okay. Um, and then on this side, you have this little plastic part, which you can put like wet stuff, like wet, um, like any like wet swimsuits and stuff like that can go on this side. And then you have another pocket over here. Oh, and it comes with a, this is a mess. There we go. Comes with another little pamphlet. This pamphlet tells you um, like who to contact for your warranty and also because I also believe this has a lifetime warranty which is another another deal breaker for me. Um, this is, it tells you the steps of like how to do the TSA lock and then all the details you may know. Yeah, all the details that you would like to know about it it's in here um so yeah this pocket is pretty deep as well then when you get into this pocket oh, tissue paper we have the 
famous bags from Bays, and I love that it's also in this pink slash Atlas color. Atlas is the name of her daughter, and I'm assuming that um, Shay's daughter's favorite color is pink, so that's why it's named Atlas instead of pink. Um, these are like just like little like laundry bags. It says dirt bag, period. Okay, and here's another one that says not base, <laughs> not base because it's mine it's not base get it okay anyway um clearly i probably won't use it for like laundry bags if i use it for laundry bags it'll be like undergarments socks and like swimsuit um laundry bags but yes i'm glad that it does come with it, it like i said the details of this suitcase makes it worth the price i promise you so let's get into this pocket over Okay, so this is another pocket. Clearly, you can either put more clothes. I don't know. You can see. There we go. You can either put more clothes on this side, or I normally put like clothes on one side, shoes on another. Um, it's clearly the same size, and yeah, I'm honestly so freaking happy I bought this bag. Like, when I tell y'all, I've been wanting this suitcase, like a beige suitcase, for about a year. But then when I saw that they came out with this pink color, I was like, oh, girl, <laughs> I got to have it. I got to have it. Um, and, yeah, I didn't get it for Black Friday because that's Christmas time. And um, I really wanted to do, like, I really wanted to, like, give gifts this year. So I barely bought myself something for Christmas. I bought everything for, like, my mom and my cousin. So, yeah. This is my gift to myself. I guess this is a late Christmas gift. Um, one thing I can say about Bays is that their shipping, chef's kiss. I think the processing, I want to say, was like 24 hours. Like, I bought it when it came back in stock. And I think that was like last Wednesday when I was in Hawaii. I bought it. Or maybe last Tuesday. No, last Wednesday. And then I got an email like Thursday night about it being shipped out or maybe friday morning it was shipped out and then it was it was here i think this suitcase came literally within 48 hours to be honest because i was still in hawaii when this suitcase was delivered and my cousin had to go and get it for me um but their delivery is fast i know it um ships the warehouse is in california and I live in California, so maybe that's like part of the reason why it came so fast. But for me, ordering things, especially pricey things, it's very important that it delivers fast, at least for me. Because when things is over a certain amount of money, I'm just like, where is it at? I need that yesterday. And I need it yesterday too because you took the money out immediately. So I need the stuff immediately. But yeah, honestly, this is such a great investment piece. If you're somebody that travels a lot, I'm traveling a whole lot this year. Like I just got back from Hawaii. Um, I'm traveling a lot. So if this is if you're somebody that travels a lot, you clearly want a quality bag. Um, I think it's definitely, definitely, definitely worth the price. Um, they have other items on there, other like tote bags for work, um, like sling bags. They have a lot of stuff. So definitely check out Bays. This is not sponsored. I paid for this. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's def to me, it's worth it. Now, hopefully she don't let me down when it comes time to travel and get on that airplane and they do, do that toss to baggage claim. Hopefully the bag is still all in one piece, but we shall see. We shall put this to a weird test my next big vacation. I am going to New York, but I am not bringing no suitcase this big to go to New York for the weekend. Especially because that's home for me and I don't need to bring stuff, that much stuff. So, yes, we are at the end of this video. I want to say thank you so much. Um, this is my first video of the new year. And if you made it to this part of the video, I'm very thankful for you. Um, your girl is trying to hit the 4K 
watch hours so watch all my videos do do all that stuff share us comment um comment down below what you guys what type of videos y'all want me to post i am going to be posting like more travel more lifestyle like more vlogs i'm gonna ch definitely try to do that this year um but yeah put that post notification bell on because on wednesday i am um uploading a video showing what i can fit in my we can do mini bag and you don't want to miss it especially if you are contemplating on if you want to get it or not that's definitely a video that you should check out so yes i love you guys so much thanks for watching and i will see you guys on wednesday bye